Oh, hey, welcome to KSLA Overtime here on KSLA News 12 Sports. Hey, let's not waste any time. We have an exciting, another exciting week of high school football, I should say, on hand. Let's take it straight to our game. The game of the week on KSLA Overtime is sponsored by Morrison DeWitt Injury Lawyers. Hey, you saw earlier we had a good old time in Marshall, Texas and Marshall High School. We're looking to snap a skid to the Texas High Tigers. Get over a frustrating loss to Mount Pleasant last week as well. Visiting Tigers going to the ground attack first. A host of Mavericks to top this Tiger right here. And this is scooped up by Marshall's Kenneth Villarreal. Hey, Marshall's offense stalling right there. They're forced to go for the three right here from Modesto Serrano blocking that field goal. It's recovered by uh, Tim, Tigers' Tim Austin right there for the field goal, on the field goal block, rather. And it's going to go for six. Tigers of Texas leading 7 0. Mavericks, hey, they have the ball right here for, uh, in the next drive. Just hoping to top that. They're going to run the ball right here. Diego Smith going to get the, get the rock. He uh, thought he would stop for a second, had a hurdle over a guy. All of a sudden, he's going back to San Diego. Look up his name right there. We're all tied at seven over at Marshall, Texas. Our game of the week between Texas High and undefeated Texas High. And Marshall looking to hand them their first loss of the year. After a stalled Tigers drive, they're forced to punt. However, this touches a Mavericks player. Tigers' Carter Walker is on top of it. Texas High getting the football right back. And Texas getting tricky. David Potter, Citradarian ball to Cam Reitner in the end zone. He's got it. Visitors lead 14-7. What an impressive play that is. Texas High going on to get the win 30-7 over Marshall in our game of the week. Hey, let's take it down to the Sin Law. St. Mary's at a Natchitoches. Take it on Peabody. Peabody Warhorse is a good basketball school, by the way. Uh, playing host to undefeated St. Mary's, by the way. Hey, uh, St. Mary's going three and out. Peabody looking to start fast. Larry Roberts handed it off to Nate Francis, and he fakes out all the Tigers. And he's on reservation for six. He's like, we're not a basketball school. We'll play football here, too. St. Mary's saying not so fast. Mixing banks and mixing around, feeling the pressure. He says, no problem. And Ethan Busby hits a house call of his own 68 yards later. Have a tie game at the end of the first quarter right here with eight minutes left in the second quarter. Mixon Banks and hand it off to Ben Bienview. And the uh, War Horses are charging at him. But he hits him with a stiff arm and St. Mary's gets up back on top 14-7. Three minutes left in the half and Larry Roberts hitting his receiver in sight. His nickname is Obama uh, down to the sin lot. He takes it to the house, 43 yards. Kick is no good, 14-13 at the half. A Peabody getting the win over St. Mary's, 39-21. Ah, oh, some great bands right there. Carroll out of the south side of Monroe taking on uh, North Webster in a district battle, believe it or not. Knights on the 29-yard 20, uh, line. Braden Robertson, 20-yard rush to midfield for the first down. Same drive, handoff to Robertson once again. This time before he is pushed out of bounds. Yeah, tripped up, pushed out of bounds. Red zone right, or I guess I should say that they're in the red zone. This is Jacoby Lawson getting the handoff right here, and they're going in for the score. North Webster, the night time is the right time. Up 7 0. North, uh, Jacob Ware's crew getting it done early. All right, Carroll on the 27 yard line. Jason Friel's pass to Peja Roberts. That is stopped up by Avanta Curry on defense right there for North Webster. Knights on the 34-yard line now on their drive. Handoff over to Robertson. Excellent blocking right here. And he gets in for the score. North Webster up two scores. Up 14 does at that point. They go on to get the win, 21-13. We got some more scores for you. Le uh, North Cata over Lakeside, 42-24. Manny Blake and Winfield, 49-0. Mansfield over Jonesboro Hodge. Of course, very emotional week in the Jonesboro community, 39-18. Red River over Lakeview, 68-14.